Hey YouTube, it's Matt here, and um, you've probably seen this in some throwing videos before, but this is my Bostic shingling hammer, and you can actually buy this and sharpen it and put a hair shaving edge on it. It has a beard, and I like to call this my um, poor man's tactical tomahawk. A lot of people are selling tomahawks like this for $500, and you can go to Lowe's and get one for $26 and put your own edge on it. And uh, we're about to use it and see if we can open up, um, you know, uh, a car hood like a can opener. So, let's get ready. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my parents, they wanted to throw away this trash can. It's made out of stainless steel. It's pretty heavy duty. It has a dent in it. And with all respects, it's probably just about as thick as this car hood. Maybe it might be a little bit tougher. So let's see what this Bostick shingling hammer will do uh, to the trash can. It has a sharpened beard, yeah. and it doesn't have a razor's edge right now, but I can put one on it. Hopefully we won't have a repeat of what happened to RMJ and the um, oil drum. Yeah, that's right. And also this, this head, it's not like big and curved, so it's more likely to penetrate than an RMJ. Um, let's see what Th will happen. That, that was a funny video. I want to try hitting above the cut. The beard isn't cutting all that well, and I don't want to apply too much force and come back and hit myself, so I'm being safe, I'm being smart, and I don't want to use too much pressure when I'm trying to yank it out. Just hit it really hard. Right on through. Okay, cut that time. Um, I didn't really get a steady line going, but as you can see, um, that squared tip penetrated the hood just fine. It's not going to be like a cold steel panto with a point and drive in really easily. But as you can see, if you go back and watch the RMJ video, they have a round head. So that round head, when it hits, it's going to dissipate a lot of force and you're not going to get much penetration. But if you have something like this, it's not going to penetrate like a cold steel tanto or a Bowie knife or a Gurkha Kukri, but it'll p penetrate well, just like that. So um, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope people start spending their money like on a shingling hammer. Uh, Cobalt, they make one, uh, Bostic, and they usually have some wooden handled shingling hammers. I wouldn't recommend that. I, I, I would get one uh, that's made out of steel. Uh, okay, see it cut right there, and it's really tough, and see this thing's not super sharp right now, but it'll take a huge bite, you gotta be accurate, but it'll take a huge bite out of a 4x4, four four because of all the mass up here, so I think it's a really good tool, and let's try the back end since we have the camera going. You can see that act like a meat tenderizer. So I didn't get much penetration, obviously, but um, you know, you need to bash a window, uh, perhaps a center block or something. That's going to work quite well. So uh, thank you for watching, and go out and buy you one of these. Don't spend $400 on a uh, tactical tomahawk. Go get you a shingling hammer and sharpen it up. Thank you for watching.